Hi everybody, welcome back to a new video where I am so excited to be working in collaboration with Country and Stable to bring you quite a few exciting videos over the next coming few months with some goodies that they have sent me in this absolute ginormous box. <laughs> so I thought I'd do a little unboxing haul of everything that they have sent me so that you know sort of what is coming up if you've got any guesses of anything that I'm going to be filming and doing and any video ideas but nonetheless thank you so much to Country and Stable for collaborating with me doing some product reviews like I said doing a few different content pieces yeah I'm just so excited but nonetheless let's get into the video showing you exactly what they sent me So I have popped the box on the floor because it's rather large that I can't actually see inside to grab bits out. But we'll let's try and do it in a bit of an order to then grasp if you can gather what sort of the content is going to be for the coming videos. So the first collection of items are I love being organised, I hate not being organised and everything nice and neat. So I got a new stable hanger. It's a Shire's one in black. Oh, then in this goodie bag, I obviously got one of the Red Gorilla buckets. These are so handy. I use them for bathing, quickly washing tails, filling up their water buckets in the evening, first aid, anything like that. I've already got one in the exact same colour, so this would be really handy. So I have like a separate sort of first aid one and sort of yard one. So first in here is one of the Lickit Starter Kits. Now this is in the gorgeous lilac colour. So the lilac holder is for Maya. However, Quinn is currently on a box rest because he was a tit in the field and has come in lame and bits foot sore after pulling a shoe off. So he's had one of these lickets today. <laughs> However, in the lickets starter kit, you get two sets of bags of treats. So we've got mint and eucalyptus, apple and cinnamon. So I'll add them onto my ever-growing treat shelf. <laughs> We then obviously have the actual liquid holder. So like I said, this one is for Maya. So it is in her purple lilac color. Then you get three liquids in here. So like I said, Quinn has eaten the cherry one already, but you get a apple one and you get a carrot and you also get a cherry. So they are the liquid starter kit set. This is also a really good present idea as well. If it's anyone's like birthday or Christmas or anything like that. So, Next are just some little bits that Country and Stable sent me as extras, which is super kind. So I've got a ear warmer headband, which hopefully I think is thin enough to go under my riding hat, which will be really helpful. If not, these are my absolute go-to in the winter. Ooh, I love wearing them. And it's got the lovely little Country and Stable branding on the front. Along with that, I got some more treats <laughs> for the ponies. So some meant to be little sort of, they look like, well, they're like kind of like Rolo packets for people. Um, some treats. And then got a nice little country and stable tote bag, which I will be using probably when I hopefully go back out competing a bit because it'll be really handy to put some competition stuff in when I have all my riding gear and things. I think that'll be really helpful. So I'm going to pop that over with my competition bag. Next we have an Equi Ping. So I love these. I, after a horse on my yard had an accident being tied up to baling twine, she the baling twine didn't give, it didn't flip. She flipped over and broke her withers. I've been really cautious about tying them up to baling twine. So I've been loving these Equi Pings. Um, yeah, so these are a must have, I would say, for your stable area. Um, they work on like pressure release. So if the horse pulls, a bit it doesn't give but if a horse pulls in a dangerous situation they give and they are fab for that 
um, especially having Quinn who likes to pull back quite a lot. Um, yeah, these are ideal. So I've got an equi pink. Can't go wrong, always need some plaiting bands. So as you know, Quinn's got a mane, very, very long, flowing, lovely mane. I plait him up all the time, um, plait his mane up all the time even, um, to keep it sort of nice and keep it growing long. Obviously, he doesn't get tangled in the way, he doesn't stand on it. Um, so yeah, I am always in need of plaiting bands. Next, I got two of these chain rings to go with a chain guard and this one is in blue so this one's going to go to quinn and then the black one's going to go over to myers stable so this one of the higher question ones now our stable doors are abnormally long here in our stable so i do actually have to buy extra links to fit onto here um but yeah it's really easy to like make them fit on so i have got one of them i then have a winter must have mm -hmm. Uh, pig oil spray for their legs and their feathers and the bottoms of their tail that is a must have for the winter and also their coat shine and condition too so that's kind of like one section of everything together and then oh, next part i have the red gorilla translucent lid um i have the horses on full livery two of the days because i live so far away from the yard so these are really handy for when i pre-make up their feeds that they stay nice um, in the bin on the long lines of feeds. We have two blue hay nets and two purple hay nets to match a blue and a purple feed bucket. Any guesses what the horse's colours are? <laughs> so two blue for Quinn, two purple for Maya, and these are the Halish nets, so the holes are a bit smaller because both ponies are piggies and scoff everything. And then last but not least, two feed buckets. So again, a purple and a blue for Quinn and Maya, um, so that I have enough buckets that I can obviously say pre-make their feed when I go away. And it's always handy just to have spares as well, because horses like to break everything, as we know. <laughs> so that concludes my country and stable haul. Um, I hope you have enjoyed, and I really am looking forward to doing the work with the country and stable over the next few months and seeing all this stuff go together. So with that i will see you in a new video very soon and i hope you have enjoyed don't forget to like comment and subscribe